Our enterprise is more than 70 years old. It has been producing metal bridge structures its whole life. Today, its capacity is 55,000 tons per year. We always strive to optimize our production processes. About 10 years ago, we had around 2,200 people, and now we have 1,500, without any losses in the throughput. One of the ways we can achieve our striving is through automation of our production. We produce either in low volumes or one-offs even. It takes a lot of time to reprogram our processes if we compare it to the time it takes to produce one item. When we were searching for programming solutions, we found Abaji. At that time, we thought that their solutions looked too sci-fi-esque to be real. Abaji offers full automation of programming and creation of real-time control programs, all done with the help of technical vision and their software. We implemented it to the fullest. Abaji allows us to quickly create a control program and our robot can do the work a second after. We are a one-off production, and the solution allows us to weld slabs and diaphragms for the first half of the day and then load up beams or T-beams. We now see how effective this is. Abaji's robotic welding system got our production set up to the point of being uptime 92% of the total work time. We operate in three shifts, bringing that total to 24 hours. Out of the 92% of total time, when the equipment is operating, 53% is the arc time or gun-on time. This number is good for any equipment and even more so for welding equipment, because welding requires a lot of preparation. We compared that time to the time our welders require. Results showed that a human can deliver around 10 to 15 percent of arc time from the total work time. Meaning the difference between a human and a robot is threefold. Aside from direct comparison, we must take quality and replicability of the result into account. When work is done manually, everything depends on how good a welder is. You can have a good welder in the first shift, a mediocre one in the second, and a beginner in the third. Robots allow you to never worry about this issue again. A robot maintains the exact same quality during the entire period of its operation. This results in higher efficiency not only during the welding process, but also in the entire production cycle, including grinding and painting. We see that robotic systems can help us automate around 50% of all the welding processes in our production. We are not there yet, so we have a goal to reach, which we intend to. We have installed a second system with one robot on a gantry. It is also the KUKA robot, and it works off the Abaji software. At the moment, it works nicely. We are planning to get a welding system with four robots, which has bigger dimensions. We are also planning a laser cutting system to work with profiled metal and sheet metal. Aside from that, we are also thinking of automating the painting process. As you can see, we have big plans for automation in our enterprise. One of the myths about introducing robots into manufacturing at any given enterprise is that a robot is only good for large-scale production. The first point a customer will make is that robots are used in automotive manufacturing, whereas we have low-scale production here. This project has shown that automation on such scales can be done and is beneficial. Manufacturers should not be afraid to take steps towards robotization and get involved in such projects.